Welcome back everybody to Terraria, the modded series. So we're going to be doing a lot in this episode. I'm going to be doing, if it sounds like I'm slurring my words, it's probably because I am. Um, I just got back from the, well, I didn't just get back from the dentist, but I am numb in my lips and I needed to get, I needed to record because I am a little bit late with, uh, you know, some videos on this channel. But the thing about it is, is that um, I know we're doing back to back Terraria, but I have to. Um, I'm really interested in this modded series. And it sounds like I have a stroke. <laughs> but, um, yeah. So, if you guys didn't see the stream that I did of this of this series. In the stream, we got the refined storage. So, we have up to 320 items. Because I made three of these bad boys. Actually, I have four of these. And I put the uh, demonite grade on each and every one of them. Which gave us the... Uh, uh, Gave us the ability to put at least 320 items. Um, if I run out of space, I'll go ahead and make more to go to the crafting interface right here. Because we can, indeed. Since th since everything is inside the refined storage, all we have to do is just craft right from here. If I wanted to make a storage connector, I can make uh, lead bars in 100. Um, which will allow me to connect these nice refined storage units together. Which is great. I do have some potions, which I might use as gravitational potion, by the way. Uh, which will be great. I can use the gravitational potion to find some floating islands and also Probably try to kill as much as harpies as I can. I do have this it came from the eye of Cthulhu uh, Probably because I'm modded I would assume and then I have this this cool looking thing that sounds like coins But uh, the reason why I'm waiting for morning is because I do want to uh, use the gravitational potion to find some floating islands because um, I think I'm gonna need it we only have one diamond, which is unfortunate. <laughs> Why don't we just go ahead and use it right now? Um, because it it's gonna help. We're gonna it's gonna help. We're gonna need it. Okay, all right. That's new. These are new. Clearly, clearly, something new. There's something in the middle there, so definitely want to go down and check what that is. Ah, uh, one of those things. I, I don't know if I should deal with these. All right, hang on. We're going to go this way because definitely we only have three minutes. I don't know if we have enough time to explore a big bunch of shit. I, I wanted to find some floating islands, not, not a big bunch of weird stuff. Although there's, there's some pretty cool stuff right there. There's like, wow, what? This is a big bunch of stuff that is being protected by this is the core of the it looks like this is the core of the little planet didn't expect that i'm surprised i didn't find no harpies actually we're gonna actually have to oh man we're gonna have to find a way to make it up here because there's a lot of planter boxes like a herb bag some freaking life force potion which is really hard to make it's actually time consuming it's not hard to make i don't know what the hell i'm talking about uh but um yeah no we're gonna we're gonna get out of here there's a, it looks like there's another one like right next to us. There is a lot of iron ore here, which looks like the whole freaking planet was made out of iron. Okay. That's really cool, by the way. Look, it's Australia. <laughs> All right, let's, let's go take a look at uh, some other stuff. Wow. Didn't expect to find that. We'll probably build up to it. I do need to find some harpies, though, because we do need some feathers. Found another weird planet thing. Oh, it's a jungle thing. What is this? Where is this mod? There's clearly honey stuff. Oh, there's a, a chest in there. And it says a bee mine cart. Okay, well, cool. I'll take it. And I'll go ahead and mark these harpies here. Because I am ready to... Oh, nope. We are not... We don't got no more gravitational potion. Oh, that's unfortunate. That's okay. Uh, Did I get any feathers from that? I did not. I did not get no feathers. Ah, man. That kind of sucks. <laughs> <laughs> Why did I start talking like that? I have one way to check if there is some floating islands and it is to find some s stuff. So we, first of all, we need to go back to the house because we need to get some ropes. All right, let's see. Does it work? It works. And then we can just go ahead and do this. Beautiful. Beautiful. As we need to grab some rope. We only have 103 rope, which I thought we would have had more. As long as I can get up high enough to find some harpies wait what am i talking about hang on hang on what are we doing what are we doing i only have so much freaking rope watch out nurse this fool sells nurse uh this yeah he sells a nurse i forgot that he sells rope um cool we got a a pylon too actually i'm gonna put the pylon over here i think uh the forest pylon should go in here you can stay there witch but you will change pretty soon 
And then the nurse, actually, the witch, sheesh, nurse goes here for right now. I know the nurse likes the arms dealer. Yes. We made it. I might actually take some of this stuff, though. We're on the planet. This is actually really cool. I, I kind of like this thing. All I have to do is mine in here now. Uh, I guess we can take whatever's in here. Loot all. Loot all. I uh, don't need the chest because we have refund storage. So we have a big bunch of, like, boxes. What is this? Uh, it's spent in storage. Its furnace will still burn strong. Okay. I kind of want to see. Did I want to see what this was? Oh, no. I already got that. All right. Let's. Okay. So we're going to go ahead and go this way. We haven't even uh, hit. I didn't mean to hit that. We haven't even hit the jungle just yet. So let me check right here. I see a little bit of water. It, 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 I mean, it could mean anything, but that's normally how you find floating islands. But we'll see. I knew that's how you find- I knew- I knew that's how you found these. Alright, this is actually a good one, so. Uh, lucky horseshoe. We probably didn't really need any of this stuff anyways, but we'll go ahead and take it. Uh, we'll definitely go ahead and mine some of the cloud that I need. As long as we have the double jump. Uh, there's probably some other, like, modded stuff I can get that's probably way, way, way better. But like I said, just playing base, uh, Terraria until we get into, like, the modded stuff. But right now there's not a lot. There is some modded stuff that I can probably do right now, but... There's just so much stuff that I, I really don't know what, what I'm doing. All right. We're definitely going to go this way. By the way, this is a boss, and that's why it has a big bunch of health. I looked it up. Uh, I actually looked it up for my last episode, and I seen it, at, and I seen it, and I was like, I kind of wonder what the hive tumor is. And it said it was a boss. All right. You know what? I actually think I'm ready to fight the, the wormy, Mr. Wormsley. I'm definitely going to go ahead and just get a couple of potions. Like, I'm going to grab some iron skin, maybe some life ores. And yeah, we're going to go ahead and uh, probably try to defeat the... Uh, I think uh, we should be able to do it. Uh, we should do some of the other ones. We'll probably have to come back to these ones. But definitely, I want to get into hard mode in this series. So, let's go ahead and do it. Uh, I don't, oh, let me go ahead and make some scar bombs. I believe I can make a few of them, actually. There is another corruption, too. If I need to use the other corruption as well, I can, I can go to that one instead. I think that one's gonna be my best bet. Now, if I'm gonna make it to where I, I can't find like any of these like spheres or like the main areas where all the demon altars are, um, I'm definitely gonna need to figure out how I'm gonna do this. Wow, why are they like this for? Is it the mod that does this or like, I'm kind of confused because like, I'm not even finding any demon altars. All right, there's something clearly rigged and we need to bomb a big bunch of this area just to see all right, I think we found out what we needed to find. We need to we we needed to find what we needed to find. I don't know why it was so far down though. It's like it shouldn't be this far down, right? Did I get that one? All right, that does 32, and this one does 19. So screw the 19 one. Hell yeah! Now we got a big one. Like I'm never gonna use it because this I got this sword that did 52 damage like right away, and normally you get stuff that does 52 damage after the wall flush, but. The mod is going to unbalance games. I'm going to find some, uh, a thing that can make me, give me bombs at least, which sh should be like, kind of like pots in here. But they're those, yeah. They're those things. We are full health. Here we go. Here we go. Let's zoom out. Whoa. Holy crap. This is insane. Why did I decide to do it here? I can't get out. No. Get over here. Wait, am I actually, like, possibly, like, actually win? Yeah, just keep doing that. Wow, this is easy. All right, let's zoom in. And I'm over here thinking that I'm going to die. We're definitely going to get a lot of Demon Knight ore from this. We're definitely, we're definitely ready for this, I'm going to tell you. We definitely were ready for this. I'm getting a lot of stuff that's filling up my inventory. Well, I am getting a lot of those weird emblem things, which I don't know what they do, but uh, maybe someone will enlighten me in the comments, maybe? Maybe, I don't, not too sure, not not 100% sure, but this is an easy win. We got, uh, we got some stuff. We got this, which can be transmitted into any potions. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna have to look that up. Actually, I can just put the scales inside. I forget that I can craft through, through with this, okay. Yeah, now we can just make a big bunch of bars. And I can make the nightmare 
pickaxe, which I'll just craft one because that's all we're gonna need. <laughs> I don't. Oh yeah, we can we can make a storage unit. Uh, it says tungsten. So the way I guess the way this storage unit works is it's gonna take. So it says shows how much I have. It takes of any silver, and I think I can only make probably one max stack. I can make two. Nice. But so yeah, let's go ahead and just go down to the underworld right now. Do what we need to do right now. But we can mine down if we want. But we already have a elevator pretty much. Let's just try to go to, to the lowest point. Uh, I'll probably cut this because this is probably going to take me a little while. So I'll put a glow stick right here. And I'll see you guys back when I either reach the underworld or don't. I found one of those uh, cave things that are going to drop ruby. I thought that was topaz. I'm colorblind. Not really, but... And there's a chest right there. Probably not anything worth getting, but I'll take it. I won't take the chest because we have better chest, but... Actually, I found a really big house. That's actually quite... I don't know how lucky it is, to be honest. I really don't know anymore. <laughs> wow. A cloud in a bottle. I wonder when I wanted that. <laughs> Lava is getting in the way, so we're going to have to shift... Dude, I'm getting so much diamonds right now. Like, I've never found this much diamonds in Terraria. What are you? You are a diamond crawler. Please, do not go into the lava, please. I'm honestly thinking about fighting Skeletron uh, in this episode of Terraria modded series. I was thinking about doing it because I don't know how, I don't, but I don't know how like strong I am at the moment, but I don't know. We can always check. I will take all that platinum ore. Yes, I will, I will indeed. Wait, does Vein Miner work on freaking... Because if Vein Miner works on Hellstone, I can probably get some Hellstone. We're going to need to somehow drain that out of the Platinum. Let me go ahead and zoom in. I can barely see. I'm a little blind here, folks. And there's a fire imp already ready to eat me. All right. Oh, no. I'll die. Oh, you guy. How is it going? I don't think there's anything over here. I think it's a little bit too close to Hell. Um, or the underworld, whatever you want to call it. It's the same thing, you know. It's it's hell, alright? There's torture souls down there. I actually made my eyes water when I did that. What the fuck? <laughs> this is insane, dude. My acting is getting way better. Alright, it is very scared to use acrobatics. Because I can't... Yeah, see. It's kind of hard to... I'll take the uh, hell forge, though. Let me see if I can just... I'm going to need some obsidian. A voodoo demon already? Like, I can't believe... I'm this buff already. Oh, nope. I died. And I lost the gold. <sighs> we make a couple of extra homes. I, I say a couple of extra because we're definitely... Okay, that's a little bit too tall. Like, man, save on some freaking resources. Shit. We're definitely going to need some, like, NPCs to spawn in. So, I'm definitely going to build them right here. This is going to be, like, the NPC ho hotel until I can get them into their own homes. This is just for them to spawn in at the moment.
I just don't want like too much of the mod ones to spawn in because I don't know anything about the happy happiness of the modded ones. I just need like like the arm. If I, if I if I get the arms dealer to spawn in, it's gonna be great because I can go ahead and I can make a no. But I can use the gray bricks to um build a nice little house in the desert for both the arms dealer and the nurse. Should we go fight Skeltron? Should we try to go fight Skeltron? We have arrows. We have bows. I have a bow. And we can go ahead and grab potions. The idea, we might have enough time, we might not. But if we don't have enough time, then whatever. I guess we'll just come back, but let's go. Quick, quickly. We'll see how difficult it is, is basically my point. Hell yeah, that was so hard to get over the last time. I did. I, I explored this off off camera at the time. I was like, I just need to know what's over here. I need to know if like we have a dungeon. I need. I just need. We need to know, for the sake of YouTube. Like, all right, let's see how hard you are. You are not difficult at all. What? This is gonna be easy, even without potions. If I defeat you now, this is insane. Like. There's no freaking way you're this, like, quite easy, right? Please tell me you're not gonna leave, cause like, yeah. Oh, it's morning, so he killed me. Right. Skeletron has killed every player, I forgot Skeletron does that. I will let you guys stagnate for a little bit. I gotta wait until nighttime. But, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and just put some stuff away. I don't even know if I'm gonna need some of these. Wait a minute, hang on. Oh man, this this is actually gonna be kind of like interesting, to say the least. Oh. I usually always avoid these things, but since vein miner, I since I have vein miner, dude. Oh man, like be my guess, like vein mine all this. I know, I know, guy. Come on, give me a break. Give me a brick, okay? A brick of bread. So I guess I'm gonna, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna turn on, I'm gonna go ahead, turn the light on in here. It's pretty dark. Well, I kinda want that thing, to be honest. My chain chandelier now. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and skip this until it turns nighttime. I really do need to make that pocket watch, but I really don't know how to get a table and chair into the other, uh, into the crafting interface. And uh, so, you know, <laughs> we're gonna just wait here until uh, it gets dark. And that is the background music of a Terraria night. Let's go. You better not just like do something, but then again, it was morning last time. So if you're gonna sit up there, I'm gonna go ahead and just shoot you with the freaking bow. I have more time on the bow than melee. So might as well just go ahead and do it. We're getting really close though. I lost my good arrows. Might as well just do that. Gucci gang. This sucks. Cause uh, we kind of like polluted our inventory. Now we can actually unlock the gold chest, at least. Oh, look at that. Here, I'll sell I'll sell you some stuff right now, actually, because, like, I need to get rid of some stuff out of my, like, inventory that I don't need, like. Um, if I can't pick anything else up, I'll probably just allow things to go on into my, my, uh, bag. Whoa. The thing about it is that I really don't want, like, everything just to, like, spawn or auto, like, stack into my, um... It, it ain't good to have everything just auto stack into your, your, you know, ore bag. It's quite all right. Quite. If I use vein miner on these spikes, will they all go away? Oh my God. All right. Yeah, there's definitely a lot here. Uh, but I did, see, there is a lot of chests back over here that I did pass up. And I'll love to use some vein miner on all those spikes. We, we know you're mad and stuff like that. I, I just, I, I, I can't do anything. I can't do anything for you. Okay. All right. I can't do anything for you. I like it's not my fault. Lord, Lord. Loot that. We don't need the chest. I'm not worried about the chest. Now my main question is I need to figure out Oh my lord, there's so much things right here. I think the chest died. There's a big bunch of shit spawning in here. Oh my god. 
I already killed 31 angry bones. And no, oh my gosh. All right, I guess I'm not I'm not ending this episode until after the goblin army. From the east. Don't worry, I'll go home and I'll deal with the freaking goblins. Oh my gosh. All right, we're out of here. Um we need to go. This sucks because now they're going to be killing my NPCs, so I'm I'm getting out of here. I mean, I already got them 25% cleared out. Like don't get me wrong, it sucks when you can't clear out your- when you, when you can't clear things out and it takes fucking five years for the- for you to clear anything out. It- it really does suck. So I guess I can well, I mean, I really don't care about those NPCs, because it literally is nothing but just the witch and whatnot, but... Um, I do care about you, though. Like, I would ask that you leave the dryad alone. Come on, come on. S stop with the freaking NPCs. Oh, we don't- we don't even have enough room for, uh, the old man and whatnot. I don't even know if I got the arms dealer. If I got the arms dealer, then that would have been great, but... We'll get the goblin guy after this, and I can make like a, uh... I can, ah, I can actually make a house in the snow. Yeah, goblin and the... The mechanic, they both like the, the snow, so... I will go ahead, and we will go ahead and do that. Look at that. Have been defeated. So if I push three on my number pad... Look at that. We got the... We got a lot of these actually going for us now. And then we can go ahead and put all that stuff in. See? This is all- this is all it is. We don't need to do any, like, you know, sorting out things. It makes it just so much easier. So I should have that alchemy table somewhere around here. So if I do crafting stations... And we might be able to actually craft- We can craft potions now. Because we got the alchemy table. That's how we did it. That's what I wanted to do. Uh, in this- in the sense of this... We have so much stuff in this game now already. But yeah, um, it's been two hours already. <laughs> for me, anyways. So that, yeah, that's going to do it for uh, Terraria, the Terraria modded series. Um, that's all I have time for. And I'm going to go ahead and probably not upload this back-to-back. -back. It wasn't supposed to be back-to-back, -back, but I actually like to play this game. And, and I like to do things with this game. And I really wanted to do this thing with certain things with this game. But I, I didn't want to do it off-camera. So I decided to make a nice longer you know, longer episode of this, and also, which is funny, is I started this really numb, <laughs> and now I'm not numb no more. It makes it so much. I don't know. It, it, I had I had to do something to pass some time, so it's better to go ahead and make videos as I do that. So yeah. With that being said, thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to subscribe and stay tuned for more of this series if you guys are following it, and also leave it a like. Helps out my channel a lot. And as always, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.